With summer here, local allergists are seeing a shortage of an important product needed for allergy patients. Edward Birch reports. Right now, there is a shortage of insect venom uh, extract that we use for allergy shots. Those allergy shots have been effective for decades, helping people to boost their immunity to stings from honeybee, wasp, yellow jacket, hornet, and other types of insects. But the supply of medicine has been dwindling since October, when one of the two companies which produced the extract shut down after federal investigators found contamination. As a result, long-term care is on hold for many people, says Dr. Katie Marks Kogan with South Bay Allergy and Asthma. We currently do have patients that are receiving allergy shots for venom allergy, and we feel confident that we'll be able to continue their shots without interruption. However, because of the shortage, there are some people who may not be able to start the therapy. The shots take three to five years to be effective. Dr. Marks Kogan says right now, one of her patients is not able to get the treatments, which require scientists to extract the venom by hand from millions of individual insects. And she says if you are stung, you'll find out quickly if it could be life-threatening. It will almost always occur immediately, so within, within 30 minutes. And if you find out you are at risk from the stings, she says get an EpiPen. It's the only life-saving medication that can be used in this situation. If you or someone you love is at risk of a severe reaction from a sting, you're going to want to keep an EpiPen with you. They're easy to use. You pull off the cap, plunge the orange needle into your upper outer thigh, count to five, and then you get to an emergency room as fast as you can. Obviously, just to monitor that that immediate medication helped you, in that moment. And to make sure you don't have another immediate reaction. For This Week in Torrance, I'm Edward Mertz. Thanks, Edward. Doctors are estimating a 25 to 30 percent drop in the supply.